All right, guys, so uh, like I said, we're going to be using the Bailey RDB250 bender. Um, this is a programmable, uh, programmable bender. So um, we've got the machine on. I'm running the machine in manual mode. So manual mode meaning that um, each bend is its own standalone bend. It doesn't just automatically go to the next bend. It's not a programmed part where we've got multiple bends programmed in, any of that sort of thing. So manual mode. Um, um, so we have a inch and a half tube die on a 5.5 inch radius. So uh, it's basically 11 inches if you were to bend to 180. We're gonna go ahead and bend this 90. So uh, we'll go ahead and go forward. Now, like I said, we went that 95 and a half. Keeping a little bit of back pressure on this to keep it in the die. So there's our first 90 degree bend. So now I'm gonna flip this over. And because I marked these lines all the way around, we'll line it right back up and bend the next one. Now I've got this in here just clamped tightly in place. We'll be able to move it. Um, I'm gonna put a little more pressure on here, see where we're at on our dial, which we are about one degree. So I go ahead and give this a little pull down. Now I can set my rotation gauge on here. So I'm gonna get this and I'm gonna explain what I'm gonna do here. I'm actually gonna put this on upside down and I'll explain why. So get this on here, find that zero mark. Because all I'm gonna be measuring the rotation off of this. So we were set at zero and we're gonna go over now we're, you know, we meet, we meet that zero mark again, so we went 180. Now we're gonna go down. Already went to 180, so we're gonna slide this down even further. All right, there's our nice 42 degree bend there. Now, this is what I was saying. See, you can see the profile. Now that bend is going out and down away from the center line of this, uh, what is gonna be the center line of the frame. So we're gonna put this back in. 180. Eh. All right, now you can see how that bottom bend has now kicked us back straight with this bend here. So we're here, down, and then kicking back straight. Now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side, and this will be the top tube to the frame of the rear of the car. 